when I heard the stuff was moving online, it was it was kind of scary. You've spent all this time and energy developing yourself into a better salesperson. You know, how do you convert that into the internet? So the first virtual trade show that that I personally was a part of, we all kind of noticed that everybody seemed to be sort of going in half cocked, and so we thought we could do better than that. There's got to be a way we can we can demonstrate what we actually do and in a way that gets people to interact with us and our products and let people drive robots from their computer. We had these robots that were kind of just collecting dust, and we stripped out quite a few components to make the robots drive better. And then we switched to having a camera mounted inside the robot itself. So it started off as a really simple demo and it was just a bunch of uh, upside down red solo cups. And that demo evolved, so we're lucky enough to have a Broadway set designer. She was able to design a simulated industrial disaster. It was, it was cool to see people responding to, to something that we'd come up with in terms of you know, what we felt would be an engaging event. <laughs> Zooming around the bench, she's about to hit a J-hook. Oh no, oh no. Oh, God. So you, you can do this. I, I believe in you, I got faith. Nice. You wheelie, but you got this. Nice! <laughs> Touchdown.